Anurag of Nana Saeed. A story of freelance diplomacy, intrigue, and mystery in the Far East. Seeking a curious prayer rug stolen from him, K.C. Smith, operative of the Ghost Corps, and Ali, his Arab assistant, have traced it to the forbidden city of Kundra in the Himalayas. With Lakshmini, Rani of Kundra, and Dola Rao, her chief of rifles, he follows Ram Das, the renegade high priest who has fled, taking with him the prayer rug, in the pattern of which is concealed the location of Nana Sahib's legendary treasure. While the Rani and her men go into camp, K.C., Ali, and Chandra, one of her warriors, ride ahead to scout out the trail. Arriving at the Cave of a Thousand Winds, K.C. and Ali proceed on foot to reconnoitre while Chandra remains behind with the horses. On entering the cave, K.C. and Ali are captured by Ram Dass and shown the legendary treasure which the high priest has already discovered. Now that you've found the treasure, Ram Dass... What do you intend doing with it? The treasure goes with me, Sahib, out of Nepal. See, we have arrived at my camp. Now, Sahib, one question. You have ridden to the cave of a thousand winds alone, you and Ali. I understand from Dolo Rao that no one rides the road to the cave of a thousand winds knowingly. He didn't want to ride with us. The Sahib evades the question. A direct query calls for an equally direct reply. You and Ali came here alone. That rash old fool, Dola Rao, and the willful Rani did not accompany you. You see that we're alone. You'll find our horses over there beyond the bend in the road. Good. They will take you back to the Rani when my men have finished with you. Herman... Hit the skinning knives well. You will see presently, Saib, how the skin may be removed from a living human body. You have seen nothing of the Sahib or Muhammad Ali or Chandra Sayo? Nothing, Riz Alda. One of them should have returned by now. If the Sahib and Ali remained to watch, Chandra should have been sent back. In two hours it will be dawn. One horse ridden in haste, Riz Alda. It will be Chandra. The Sahib has no doubt remained behind. Caro, Chandra! Riz Alda. Yes, yes, what news? The Sahib. The Sahib and Muhammad Ali are taken. They are prisoners of Ram Dass. Prisoners? How know you this? The Sahib and Muhammad Ali ordered me to remain behind with the horses. They went alone and afoot into the cave. Rash men. They entered the cave alone. And where is Ram Dass camped? Before the entrance to the cave. I waited along, then crept to the top of the ridge. Below in the little hollow lay the camp, deserted. As I watched, Ram Dass and his men came from the cave with the Sahib and Muhammad Ali as prisoners. I left their horses, mounted my own... Good. Go and waken all but ten men. Take a fresh horse for yourself and bring the men with their horses here. Warn them to make no noise in leaving camp. The Rani must not be disturbed, understand? Hearing and obeying. Go then and return as quickly as possible. Bring my horse. I leave the Rani in your care, Sayo. Aye. You and those who remain to watch over her will guard her with your lives. Do not permit her to leave camp without an escort. Obeying Rizalda. And what shall I tell her when she awakens? Eh? Tell her anything. Anything but the truth. Tell her I've taken the rifles into the hills to reconnoiter. Tell her I will send word when she is to follow with the remainder of the men. Aye. Chandra and the rifles, Risaldar. What your rifles, Risaldar? And your mouth? The life of Lakshmini is in your hands, Sayo. I hold you accountable for her. With my life, Risaldar. Good. Men of Kundra, forward! There is all dark. Against the blackness of the sky, one may see the rocks beside the trail. Beyond is a slight ridge. The camp of Ram Dass is there. Dismount here, men! You, Hassan, remain here with the horses. Hold them there behind the rocks off the trail. Now separate and surround the camp. When I give the signal to attack, go forward. 
we attack at once three Sauda? That depends on what Ram Das has done or will do with the Saeed and Ali. As long as neither are harmed, we shall wait until dawn. Here, Rui Saldar. Just beyond this little ridge is the camp. Listen. <laughs> no guards on their back trail, and none to protect their camp. One can readily see that Ram Das is not a warrior. Look. Ram Das with the Sahib and Muhammad Ali and the guard. There by the fire. And the men. There. Just beyond the camp. One may make out the cliff and the mouth of the cave of a thousand winds. The men are on the ledge before the cave. What are they doing? By Rama. Look, Chandra. They come from the cave with sacks of goatskin and chests. The treasure of Nana Sahib, Rizaldar. The tales told of this vast hoard of gold and jewels are true. Aye. There are many skins and two chests. They appear to be heavy. Were it not well to attack at once? Our rifles must have surrounded the camp by now. Nay. Let the fools bring the treasure out of the cave to the fire. We shall have less work to do. Look. They strip the clothes from the Sahib and Ali. And the one there by the fire. Lifting knives from the flames. By Rama. They would skin the Sahibs alive. Give the word to attack us, Aye. Up, men of Kundra! Forward! Ram Dass and his followers stood in momentary frozen consternation. Then, dragging the heavy sacks and chests, several spring toward the grouped horses. Dola Rao's attackers have already placed themselves between the renegades and their mounts and rush to meet them with savage yells. Almost immediately, the battle becomes a hand-to-hand fight between individuals. Rifles are quickly emptied and tossed aside. Swords and knives take their place, and the clash of steel on steel supplants the rattle of gunfire. Aye, aye, if my hands were unbound, I would like nothing better than a chance to meet that Hindu dog, Ram Das. You wouldn't have the chance. Look, he's running, trying to reach those horses. They don't get him now. Dolaro! Here! Aye, the dogs are beaten, Saeed. A few moments and there will be none left to... Quick, cut these cords. Uh, there, Saeed, you're free. And after you've freed Ali, both of you go on with the cleanup. When you've finished, take prisoners and treasure to our camp beyond the pass. And you, Kasi? I'm going after Ram Dass. I'll come back when I finish. Come, come, Ali. We follow the Saeed. He needs no assistance, friend. He will bring Ram Dass back alive or dead. But give me a good sword that I may strike a blow for Lakshmin. <laughs> Here, then, one of mine. And we, men of Kundra, take no prisoners. No word has come from Dola Rao or the Saib? None, Rani. Dola Rao should have returned or sent word long since. You say he left with 40 rifles? To reconnoiter in the hills, yes, Rani. With 40 men. The Risalda of Dola Rao has ridden to the cave of a thousand winds. Say, Sayo, is that not the truth? The Risalda did not say so, Rani. Hmm. And the Saib? As Sayo has twice informed the Rani Lakshmini... The Saib left soon after we made camp to scout out the trail ahead. He was accompanied by Mohammed Ali and the Havilda Chandra. Yes, yes, so you said. But one or the other should have sent word to me. Sayo, if aught has happened to the Saib... We would have learned of it from Chandra or from Mohammed Ali. We must have patience, O Rani. Patience, patience. We have waited over long as it is. Perhaps a messenger is even now on the way hither. Send someone to ride the trail immediately. No. Wait. Saddle my mount and bring him here. I shall ride a little way to meet this messenger. An escort of five rifles to accompany the Rani? Leave the rifles to protect the camp. I ride alone. With Sayo, Rani. Very well. But make haste. <laughs> 
Hearing and obeying, Rani. Rani Lakshmini would be wise to turn back. We have ridden far from camp. But a messenger. We have encountered none. No, we will ride on a little further. As Lakshmini wills. It is perhaps that the messenger has reached camp by another trail. Oh, there are no other trails. He would have to come by this one. Unless he came from the hills. Stop. What is it? Listen. The messenger. You see, Tayo, as we turn back. Look, here he comes. Around the bend in the road. He rides fast, Rani. It... It is Ram Dass. He has a rifle. Sayo, shoot! Shoot quickly! I fire Rama, the dog! 